What's going on everyone? It's me, ya boy, Alex the Rambler, and today we're going to be trying out the World War One mod for Napoleon Total War. Isn't that right, World War One Jeeves? I don't want to be here. A few weeks ago I decided to try out the World War Two mod for Rome Total War, and years ago I actually tried out this mod. I think I did a let's play of it, but I didn't actually finish it. I think it kept crashing. Uh, but we're going to give it another try today and just show you how a game set in Napoleon Total War functions in the World War One era. Now, I hate to do this, but whenever you interact with the video, it really does help it reach more people. So if you wouldn't mind leaving a like, uh, leaving, leaving a comment, subscribing and all that jazz, it, it really does help out. Especially on a non-Hearts of Iron video, it, it, it helps it out even more. So we will begin a World War One campaign. Uh, you can play as all of the major nations and minor nations. So like, for example, you could even be Switzerland, even though they didn't really take part in, in World War One. And I think the developer of this mod actually works at Total War now. So he went from making a mod to getting a job at the studio, which is... Kudos to that fella. I think it might be fun to play as France. Pin down the Germans and... I think that's... Yeah, we only have one front, unless Italy decides to betray us. And look... This is the leader for our nation. Ho ho! I am recording, aren't I? Oh, thank golly gosh, I am. Gameplay options. Advisor help. No. Battle time limit. Yeah. Automatic city management. No. Show CPU moves. Ha! Huh, that's like cheating. I don't need those. So it's just telling us uh, that we lost the Franco-Prussian War, but in 1914, France is a powerful nation with many resources, it's a solid industry and a huge supply of manpower. Aha! Let's go! We don't need the UK, just France. France all the time. Would you like to enforce loyal factions? They'll try to keep major alliances of World War One together. Well, that seems fun. And do you know what? If we get 5,000 likes on the video, I'll do one where we don't. How's that? We do have a few armies already. Uh, the main one is in Paris, so I think that should be able to defeat the Hun, shouldn't it? So we'll march them straight out of Paris. I don't know what that does to my public order. Public order's still fine. Oh my god, how slow do you go? But we can always have more artillery. Oh my gosh. Artillery only? Anyone? Anyone? Or is that finally a dead meme now? <laughs> Please, let's stop with the artillery only. Hold the phone here. What's that? Uh-oh. Watch out for the commies if you build a soup kitchen. No, 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 no. We don't want that now, do we? So I'll send in my little uh, spy over here. You can... Oh. Bomb. Bomb them. Bomb that bit... What we build? Bomb the craft workshop, sir. Yeah. Bomb the craft workshop, sir. Sir! Oh. Fine. I guess you'll have to infiltrate first. Or maybe he won't. He'll just die. <laughs> Oh, for God's sake. Okay, so we're led by Raymond. Uh, we do have... Oh, wow, we do have a very nice population there. And let's see, what kind of policies do we have? Aut ah! Taxes! Bam! Okay, maybe not, maybe not. Oh, they don't mind They don't mind higher taxes, the middle class. Lower taxes, they don't... Okay. Yeah, I think we'll go for medium to high taxes. Very good. And now I could replace... Oh, my God. Look. You will make fun of me for being bald, but four-sixths or two-thirds of, of the cabinet and the leader of France is bald. So, you know what? I'm keeping him. Look how good he is with his money. Now, we don't want to forget about our research. I definitely want the re-implementation of the mortar. Uh, then we'll also want to go down trench warfare and look at all of these things we can get once we start doing that. Well... That's a bit of a problem. Okay, the first French army is going to try and seize Strasbourg. Uh, we lost it in the Franco-Prussian War, but I think we can get it again. But first I'll have to attack... Is that Metz? Yes. Sending reinforcements to that army. And we now have mortars to add to that army too. Oh, the, f the, 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 the Hun aren't going to know what's going to hit them with my big, big... Um, guns. Now, I think that Napoleon is a particularly hard Total Water mod. Uh, you, you'll kind of see how they've changed all the armies once we actually get into a battle. I, I am trying to move there as quick as I can, but the, 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 they can only walk. I have no vehicles at the moment. Oh, yes. Uh, I definitely think I'm going to go down the Trench Warfare Doctrine. 16 turns. Are you having a giraffe? Maybe I should just go after socialism. 
No, no, Alex, that would be crazy. Don't do that. <laughs> okay, our first conquest of Mets. Bam! Done it. Oh, I forgot about them going after Be- Oh, it's like- It's like- Oh, dear. Um, okay, maybe this- <laughs> Ooh, they're gonna take out Belgium, aren't they? Um, I think I've made an oof here. Never fear, we've got another ball general and he's confident. I've got faith in Joseph Joffrey. I don't know how I actually completely forgot about the Germans attacking Belgium. I, I am a bit of a moron sometimes. <gasps> Spain! Yes! I'll have an alliance with you. Oh, feck. Oh, feck. They have more artillery than me. It's already over. Oh, and they've got more... Oh, dear. Um... Right, well, I guess I'll do a quick old save a Rooney here and and just... Oh, no, what is... So as you can see here, we have the brave uh, French artillery. Um, I've decided just to have them on the front line because that, that seems like a smart idea. They can pound the enemy into submission. And then I have the majority of my infantry behind trenches. Uh, we're, we're already preparing for the, <laughs> for the onslaught. <laughs> Ooh. And we're in our bright um, blue uniforms. However, you can see if we get shot in the peepee... They, they won't notice because, well, it's red. So I guess we'll we'll go and just see how we do. I don't need your advice, sir. I don't need your advice. You may fire when ready. You may... Oh, for God's sake. You hit the feckin' tree. But don't worry. We're hitting him a little bit. Oh, God. They're bombing my general. Run. Run, Jeeves. Run away. Run away. And the accuracy of the German artillery is much better than the French. Good lord, this is not going well. What is happening to you? Why did you walk beyond the trench, you idiot? Oh no. Would you bloody run? Oh my god. My units are terrible. And and they should feel terrible. This is, this is awful. Okay, my infantry is now doing an okay job. Uh, we're firing at a decent rate. I think. Ah, oh, yes, we've got the Huns on the run. Please keep running. Yes. Oh, this is what we needed. It looked a bit dodgy, but if my general can just get to their position, I think we might have it in the bag. Ah, yes, shoot down the running Huns. Get them, boys. Get them. Oh, we actually did it. I'm actually, I'm, I'm quite surprised. I've, oh, heroic victory. Oh, you love to see that, don't you? Yes. Praise me. And my fantastic generalship. Uh, so I've just noticed something. That if you go on to build the Eiffel Tower, it's actually the Arc de Triomphe. <laughs> so, um, I've got a little bit of a mix-up here. And also, uh, Belgium has fallen. Uh, this, is, this is not good. In fact, it's quite disastrous. And Germany has moved into French territory. So this, is, this isn't great. And it, it appears the uh, BEF... Hasn't even come over yet, so would you get your buttocks over here, Justin Chambers, and help me out? Ah, uh, the UK's done their best and, and blockaded Belgium. And Oh, no, they did—they go on an army in recruitment, but you might want to send it over pretty zippity quick, please. Oh, I guess also another thing, with the Napoleonic map, it only stretches to... Well, Istanbul was the final city, so it's... You can't, you can't invade the rest, which is a little bit of a shame, but... Uh, that's just that's just the map. You can't really do much about that. All right, let's try and push the Hun out of France. Oh, let's go! Oh, am I, is my artillery? Fi where where is the range of my mo? Oh. oh, come on, artillery! You can do better than that, can't you? Actually, like target some of the gits, please, please. Oh, it appears my mortars are starting to hit their positions now as well, which is grand. We're taking out a few hundred of their troops before they... We're softening them up before they get to us, it seems. Oh, yes. Boom, boom, boom. Goes the artillery. You'd think their hits would be fairly accurate, but they're just not. I want them to get the freaking general. Everyone fire on that man. General sniping is the way to go with this game, obviously. Okay, they've fallen into my trap. If I can just turn this around... And then get my troops to fire on their troops. I think we'll have this one, chaps. <laughs> the classic Rambler envelopment. I've patented this, so no one else can take it. 
Oh, yes, we got the cavalry going in from behind. They never stood a chance. Take that, hun. Now that's pretty good. I like losing 200 men for them losing 1,300. That's noish. I'm going to construct the Arc de Triomphe Eiffel Tower. Yes. Oh, for God's sake. Classic French, eh? Workers on strike. What? Did... We're at war and people think... What happened to patriotism, eh? Stop striking. I'm liberating Belgium and then I'm thinking I'm just going to occupy it because, hey, I don't need to give it to them. Oh, I could liberate. Hmm. Yeah, you know what? Let's liberate them. I'll liberate the Belgian just... No idea where the Germans have gone to now. Oh, they're back there. Oh, the bastards. I'm uh, coming for you. Hold the phone. The Germans are actually trying to get peace with me. Are you insane, Mr. Frederick Wilhelm? No. I say... But actually, I don't want that. But I, I would take a region. I would like Alsace-Lorraine. Oh, you What? War it is, then. So I'm not really sure what other kind of mods you might like to see from the Total War world, but if there is anything, you know, of course, do let me know. I'm, I'm always open to taking a little look at random ones. Actually, I've been having, I've been hankering for some My Little Pony recently. That's something I never thought I'd say. So if you want me to cover that mod, the hoi, the hoi, the, the hoi, <laughs> the, 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 that, that one. You know what? You know which one I'm talking about. You've played it. Oh my god, auto resolve is horrible. Let's go. Sneak attack. Strasbourg! Ah! This didn't really go to plan. Uh, they don't have a general, though. And I did an auto resolve and won. Okay. I will peacefully occupy Alsace Lorraine. I didn't expect auto resolve to do that, but hey, I'll, I'll take it. And they won't stand a chance now if we do a cheeky auto there either. Well, I'm now attacking Stuttgart, and it appears they've sent forward some some sorry, some sorry looking fellows, uh, the armed citizens. Uh, I, I, I've decided to bring with me more artillery than ever before, and we'll just see how, how this goes. Um, armed citizens against field guns. This should be, this should be fun. So the artillery is already firing. Uh, <laughs> I think they're going to have quite a lot of fun. They've got. A lot of targets just to fire onto. So, you know, do, do your worst, artillery. You may fire. When ready. Oh, they're not pointing up like how, I, how I'd really like. Where are they going? So the Germans have decided to clump all their men in, in one spot. Uh, I'm, I, I don't know why that is. Although it, it, this strategy it does appear to be working because my artillery can't seem to hit them. Are you serious right now? Oh, no, there we go. Finally. Finally, a couple of nice hits. So I think this is kind of when um, the game kind of shows its weakness. When you kind of just get the troops running towards you kind of piecemeal. For example, this 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 poor sorry unit of Germans here. They're, they're, they're having a hard time of it. They're, <laughs> they're going to try and shoot my French troops. Um, wait, oh, no, they can't even get there. Don't, but don't worry. Don't worry, everyone. My artillery is doing a good job of, of killing my own men. So... You gotta love it when that happens, don't you? I I do kind of feel uh, like th this is how it would have gone in No Man's Land. You've just got the people staying behind the trenches, just firing into people trying to assault your positions. It's horrific, absolutely horrific. I would not like to be in there. Sh and right, rightly they're running away. Rightly they're running away. I don't blame them at all. Ah, there we go. All done, and that should be Barden taken. This is going very well. Oh, and that replenishment rate. Oh, I, I love to see this. I went for a peace treaty with the Germans. They're, they're, they were getting a bit too powerful for me. Uh, however, I'm still at war with Austria-Hungary, so I might just go slink down in these mountains and go after Tyrol. Grab a little bit more territory for myself, you know? Oh my god, they're automatically research- What? Why would you automatically research Marx? It's socialist. No, 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 no. Machine gun cores. No, please stop. Please, please stop doing that. Flamethrower cores. Anything but. <laughs> yes. Yes. Flamethrower cores. I don't care about starvation. Just give me them flamethrowers. Ooh. Oh, yes. 
sneak attack through the Alp. Is that still the Alps? Hmm. I'm not sure. The Austrian Alps and into Tyrol. Oh, they're not. Oh, this is this is this is 6D chess. I have to say, 6D, no foeing chess. All right. Well, they've done the same to me. <laughs> Whoopsie. Wait, they. They should not be able to withdraw further on into my territory. Oh, that is rich. That is really rich. I, I really hate it when that happens because there's literally nothing I can do. Apart from like trying to keep chasing them. Oh, when my flame flowers are ready, Austria-Hungary, you're going to rue the day that you retreated into France. Hold on. When have I been at war with Italy? Are you serious? What? Oh, f feck. Oh, for God's sake, that the Belgians have, <laughs> have gone and got themselves conquered again. Why can't you do anything competent, Belgium? All right, let's see what I can do. Oh, according to this, I don't stand chance, so I'm going to demand their surrender. Oh, wait. No, that was me surrendering. Sorry, I'm just used to seeing the white flag and running away. No, 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 no. Why, why are you telling me about wine? Why are you telling me about wine? I'm at war. I, what, I want them to sally out, and then I can mow them down with my machine guns and my flamethrowers. At least that's the plan. Feck off, Italy. Yeah, ah, here we go. Okay, right. They have lots of artillery, but I have the machine guns. So if I just... This isn't going to go well, is it? I'm... 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 I... I... I um. So these are the machine guns. I don't think they're going to even get into range to fire. I really have overestimated... Underestimated my enemy. And my flamethrowers have, um... Like, no range... <laughs> so I think as soon as the, as soon as the enemy gets in in range of, of my troops, I, I I'm dead there too. I am sorry, flamethrowers, for I have sent you to your deaths. Okay, we've got them distracted. Go in, flamethrowers. Go, flame them good. Flame them good. Flame them. Flame them. Oh, I forgot about the grenades. No, flame them. Flame them, sirs! They can flame them! Flame them! Oh! Oh! No! They went out of range! At least the grenades work. You grenaded yourselves! You Oh my god! Something happened! Oh my god! Uh... That's mad! Holy heck! Oh! It's beautiful! The majority have absolutely flamed themselves to death, but... Hey! Flame on? Flame on, please! Yes! Oh, the machine guns are firing. Kind of in the right direction. While also shooting themselves. But I think this might have been another ma machine gun area where the, where the enemy just got absolutely gunned down. Yeah. They're getting destroyed. Well, I actually won. I'm very surprised that we managed to do that, but we did it. Nice. But this isn't going to be a game I will be able to end in one video. It, it, it simply would take far too long. So I'm afraid you won't get to see tanks in this one. But if you potentially want to see more of the Great War mod, please do let me know in the comments below. It's certainly a lot of fun. Um, I, I, if you enjoy this, I recommend giving it a try for yourself. The battles are a bit buggy. But it actually seems a lot more stable than the last time I played it. I don't know what's happening. Maybe my PC is just better than it used to be. But yeah, there you go. The Great War mod for Total War. If you, if you know any other wacky ones, just 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 tell me and I'll, and I'll give them a try. But for now, toodaloo! Many thanks to Onion Duck, Wyatt Green, Greencoat Gaming, Matthew Hurst, Name Name 1231, Aiden, Andrew, Jiggly Crotch, Use Beef, Martin Shaw, Sean Young, and Yogan Whaley for being ridiculous Ramba supporters on Patreon, and many thanks to all the other patrons too!